in Saigon, capital of strife-torn Vietnam, the locked gate of a temple that has been barricaded with barbed wire suggests the bitter conflict existing between the present government and its Buddhist citizens. Unrest prevails throughout the city, and a thousand heavily armed troops are diverted from the country's war with communism to police its troubled avenues. Students protest the government's measures and shout their defiance at the military patrols. They want the banishment of Madame Ngo Dinh Nhu and her husband, President Diem's politically powerful brother. But at this time, there's no effect at conciliation, and the youngsters are rounded up. Over 800 are arrested and carried off to military camps. Those over 20, according to Saigon's military governor, will be drafted into the army. A tangled situation causing deep concern in Washington, and a perplexing problem for newly appointed U.S. Ambassador Lodge, whose statesmanship President Kennedy commandeered for the emergency. As again, women must weep. <laughs> 